What up, y'all? Welcome or welcome back to Shawnee Dom. Come hang with me. Let's see what's been happening in these streets these past few days. If you're new here, I hope you'll consider subscribing. I am a dark light skin. Thank 
because I don't have the remote connected to it, which the remote is, I don't know, but I don't know. Anyway, I've been having fun with it and it's Friday, so I'm gonna take it out again today. I might just, I am probably don't go by the pool because that's why I was jerking so much because I was getting nervous by the pool and it was at one point that the wind, because it was kind of windy yesterday, and, that, and the wind started like, y'all saw behind the pool is like a little forest. And so the wind started pulling, pulling it towards the forest because I had it up kind of high. And, and at that time the wind started blowing. So I was trying to bring it back to me, but it was, it was, it was taking it. So I kept on like pulling it to me, kept pulling it to me. And once the wind finally slowed up, it released it and the thing took off and crashed into the, the uh, pool house. But I was able to catch it so it didn't break nothing. I hurt my finger though. It did hurt my finger. But yeah, I just wanted to come on here and say happy Friday. I want to say happy Friday and uh, um, I don't know if I'm going to do something today, tonight, once I get off of work, because I am working right now. Um, so we'll see. I mean, of course, I'll take y'all with me. I did. Y'all, I um, took my heels, bro. I took my hair down. Cause I just, it was just looking so raggedy in real life. Like it probably was looking raggedy on camera too. But I just let, washed it. So I got the Mr. T look going. But I'm finna run to Crystal's. I have the taste for some White Castles. And let, let's be clear, White Castles and Crystal's do not taste the same. Yes, they are smoke sliders have pretty much the same menu but the burgers do not taste the same all this time like people kept telling me like oh crystals i think i'm gonna have to get off oh crystals this is uh yeah um You gotta taste crystals to North taste Charity just Avenue. like then use the right White Castle. So, a couple years ago, I was in Atlanta. At the light, use the right two lanes they, to turn right you know, onto US got 92 a, West, East Hillsboro Avenue. They got a crystals. So, um, I was like, oh, let's go to crystals. I'm Continue like, I got the US taste of White Castle. West I think two we miles. were drunk or something. I can't remember, but, um get there i'm all excited because i'm knowing i'm gonna give me some white castle burgers these dogs get on my nerves because i'm gonna give me some white castle burgers and get back to the room bit into that burger and you know even though it wasn't it was nasty at the time because my mouth was tasting white castle burgers so when I bit into it, I, it was a shock to my tongue because that's not what I was tasting. And I'm like, I was so like disappointed because you know, you, you looking for a certain taste, but as I ate, I'm like, okay, they not nasty. They just not White Castle burgers at all. So don't y'all who be saying, oh, they just White Castle burgers. No, they not, they're not. And don't y'all listen to people that say it's just like White Castles, cause it's not, not even the same. Same burger, same, um, you know, shape, slatter, you know, all that stuff. But, and I think the patties, I mean, I think overall the patties are the same or whatever, but they make their burgers two different ways, but that good. So I'm finna go and get me one. I think, Crystals put mustard on a White Castle burgers, which I like mustard. I'm a mustard person. So it's not a big deal to me. I think that's why I'm okay with them. But yeah, y'all, my head, look at my head. My 
had just left the conditioner in it so it could kind of curl up a little bit. And I don't be looking too bogus out here because I'm fixing this how I'm fixing to be walking around. Yeah. I am, I am a dark light skin. No, you ain't. I am dark light skin. So okay, so the way it works is dark skinned. Mm hmm Brown skinned. Mm hmm Light skinned. Nope. This, red bone. No, it's dark light skin, and that's me, which means I'm brown. Ooh. Move y'all. Chili cheese fries from Crystals. It's kind of where it's warm, the cheese all. That's why I ain't no cheese either. Look how that cheese look.
I never fail. Look at my girl back there. She is out of there. I love it because that means I'm going to have a nice, easy day. Nice, easy day. Gonna go get him a bath. And then put me some clothes on. And I don't know. We are gonna find something to do. But y'all see I done got good with that uh that drone. I was letting her float in the air. I'm gonna have to get her a name. I was guiding it so much better. It wasn't so shaky. Cause I wasn't like go stop go stop like that's what i'm normally doing because i'd be scared that i'm gonna lose control but i did notice the drone couldn't go past a certain part of the park like it even when i like kept pushing it i'm like dang why i won't go forward like it wouldn't go forward and it wouldn't go to the side on one side once i was so far into the park and even at one point, I, I let it go faster. So it went to a certain point and then I just had it idle. And after it was sitting idle, it backed all the way up. It went all the way back towards the front of the park. So I'm thinking like all the wires, the light power lines and stuff is was stopping it from going so far. But that's fine because... I still was able to maneuver and learn so I did learn that as long as I'm behind it as long as I'm behind it it like left is left right is right you know all that good stuff but once I was in front of it even if it was facing the same direction it like flopped it flipped as weird as that is so oh maybe because i was facing it i don't know but it, it flopped when i was in front of it but uh yeah i love to see pit bulls like them dogs are just everything to me and i think because they get such a bad they got such a bad name because of some owners who want they dog to be vicious because they they sweet and loving just like any other dog like the guy I was seeing who gave me her he um want her to be mean like when I talk to him or whatever you know, I'd be telling him, like, yeah, she getting mean and mean. And yeah, that's how she's supposed to be. No, she ain't supposed to be mean. I mean, yeah, she's supposed to be protective over us. But at the same time, oh, man, I love me a chocolate man. But at the same time, you know, she's supposed to just want to attack any and everybody that she see. Like, dog, she absolutely hate dogs and cats. Like, she hate other dogs like the, my friend when I take her cause you know he got a um, he have a Frenchie a girl Frenchie and uh like if I put her up to the window and turn her around to the butt like she'll sniff her butt and everything but the minute you turn her around turn the baby Frenchie around to fa they face to face me going crazy like trying to just jump out the car to get her like it's it's insane but oh i just love these some pretty tits but um yeah so i really want to put her in training just to be a little more calm because like she and I think she feeds off of me because I I get now I don't get uneasy around dogs, but I get uneasy around people, and that's just because I don't know I'm an introvert and just 
like being by myself. So when I do get around people, I get anxious. And I think that's all it is with her. She gets anxious and and just be ready to... <clears throat> Okay, y'all, here's my OOTD. It's Saturday. I am wearing the crop tee that says Tampa with the camo bottoms and my ballerina flats. And got on my regular jewelry, the gold and silver. And I realized I really don't even have a black purse, so... I'm gonna just carry this. I'm gonna put the uh tuck the straps in though. So this is the OOTD. And I am wearing Valentino. I can't remember which one. I don't know which one. I threw the boxes away. Um, but it's like a rose gold color, so I don't know. All right, about to hit the door. Let's go. Actually, yeah. Do you have um, the chocolate martini? I do have a chocolate martini. Yes, and I'm gonna try that. Yes. Yeah, the, it's called a white chocolate uh, martini. And what's the express? The, the espresso martini is gonna be actually made with espresso. It's gonna have vanilla vodka in there. So, so if I had to give a recommendation, I would highly recommend the espresso martini. Okay, let me try that. I'm gonna try that. Espresso martini, really? Yeah. Please, sir. Oh, water. Oh, okay, just ice water for the table. Yes. Yeah. Perfect. I'll take these wine glasses off for you if you don't mind. Really. If you don't mind, miss, I'll take that tall wine glass. Thank you so much. I'll get some water for you. I'll get the espresso going. And if you have any further questions at all about the menu, just let me know. I'll be glad to help you with that, all right? Okay, thank you. You're welcome. I'm so big. I am so fat, like I literally need to lose some weight. I can't wait for my hair grow out. Ooh. Ooh, them grays, them grays. <laughs> I said today, I was like, I got my Mm-hmm. 
Okay, OOTD. And I will be carrying just the white bag. Oh, she look like a fashion over model. You never know she got the stomach she do. I came out here to the mall. Happy Sunday. But I came out here to the mall, y'all. And they closed. The whole mall closed today. I wonder what that's about. The restaurants and stuff is open, but the mall itself is closed. And I needed to go there because they canceled my order for these um all those slides that I have speaking of you know what I think I'm gonna take them other shoes back and back because I'm not 100% happy with them so I'm kind of happy they was closed so I could just return those but yeah y'all the whole mall closed I needed to, they had sent me an email that a pair of shoes, when I had came up to all those before, I had bought two pair of shoes. One pair was the black, with slide-in shoes, uh, sandals. The other pair was like a tan and a brown, but it was a little different material. And the lady had to order them because they didn't have my size in the store. So, they sent me an email saying that I had to go back to the same all those that I made the purchase in order to get the refund. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to actually bring those shoes back with the receipt and just get refunded for both pair or get some other pair because I don't know, I might get I need some white white sandals like slide flip flop not flip flops but you know those slide type sandals but yeah I went visiting to oh shoot I went visiting today I'm just leaving my friend house I've been gone for like four hours he wanted me to wake him up this morning so I came out here to wake him up and uh, just been hanging out, chilling with him since. And um, I really wanted to go downtown. My whole plan was to come out here, chill for a minute, because I usually never chill that long. I was just gonna come out here, chill for a minute, go back home, take the dogs for a walk, then go downtown. But I've been out here so long, we done got something to eat. Now I'm on my way home. It's four, it's after four. And I'm gonna take my babies out and probably just chill with them because I'm tired now. I got the itis. And I ain't even eat off my burger. It's this place called Beef O'Brady's out in um Val Rico. Or Brandon area. I don't know if it's Brandon or Val Rico. But it is good. It's so good. That food is good. They wings. It's good. He had some um, I think red snapper before or some type of fish. No, it wasn't. I forget what fish it was. He said it was good. It didn't look I like my fish cooked all the way. It wasn't looking that appealing to me, but he said it was good. And today was the first time I had their burgers. 
I ate half and some fries and color fries, and now I'm eating now. So I'm gonna go home, walk them, take me a nap, and if I get up and feel like going downtown, which more than likely I won't because it's already four o'clock. So if I go and do what I planned on doing, then of course I'm gonna take y'all, but if not, that's the end. The weekend is over. It's so sad because I can only get two days of a weekend. Not even two days. Not even two days because Saturday is the only day you really could do anything. After you do your chores and stuff, then you gotta do everything you wanna do at night, like kick it. Then Sunday, you just wanna chill because you gotta be ready for a whole five days of working for somebody else. And doing all the other stuff you do on top of your job. I know you love fucking me I can tell by the way you in love with me You can't get enough of me, yeah Well, I guess it's looking like you stuck with me Cause I got you sprung off in the springtime